Hey everyone, welcome to Small Screen Reactions. My name is Andrew and I'm here to direct your heart stop for season three, episode eight. I'm very excited to watch this finale of season three, you guys. I can't believe we're here. And then we're gonna have to wait God knows how long to get to know season four, but we'll get there eventually. Uh, I am very excited to see what's gonna happen and where we're gonna go, how we're gonna end things and lead for next season. I don't know. I really don't know. We've gone through a lot of stuff this season, through a lot of time, a lot of things, a lot of problems. Everyone's had issues. Everyone's trying to get fixing stuff. It's a lot going on. And I don't know how we're gonna fix it all in one episode or at least find an end point in one episode, but I guess we'll see. So... Don't forget to like, subscribe, check out Patreon for unedited reactions and early. And that's it. I hope you guys enjoy. And without further ado, here we go. This is not what I expected to happen. Oh yeah, they finally did it. I waited so long. Do not say it. Uh, no. Why Nick. Why are you like this show? No. Just no. no. Love it. Come on. <laughs> You're so cute. I'm so jealous. I mine and I kept my shirt on. Do you? Whatever makes you more comfortable. I loved every second of what just happened. Aww. Me too. Also, I feel like we're going to have to practice a lot. Oh, oh yeah, 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 of course. Oh, loads, mm. loads of practice. Yeah. Absolutely yeah. loads. You think it counts as sex? What do you mean? It's just touching. It still counts. Well, depending on what the it touching. Counts. I think sex can be all sorts of things. It's true. Yeah. It's quite the array of things that mean sex. Things we could do. Oh yeah, more things to try. You've been researching, haven't you? <laughs> You've been on Google. No. He loves to research. Okay, maybe a little bit. I'm gonna look at your internet history. Uh, oh, that's not safe. Don't do that, maybe. Choice. Oh. Oh. You've been looking at unis? Yeah. Forgot yeah. about that. Yeah, me and the girls are gonna. But my top choices are local. I've been kind of worried about being away from you. Oh. But also, you shouldn't stall your life for someone else. Well, your top choices are close by, right? And. You're definitely game, but... But I'll help you. is it really his top choices? Part of him, I think, doesn't actually... He's lying to himself and Charlie wants to go to some of those places that are farther away. Is that oh, your God. Mom? Oh, yeah, probably. She said she was going to be home right now. Oh, God. Oh, oh my God. Get clothes on. Nick, where, where, where are my jeans? Where are they? <laughs> Why are you laughing? He's so, so, he's so goofy. <laughs> where are they? At least it's <laughs> at his house and not Charlie's house. Apart. Oh no. Are they, go are they going to be apart? Is he going to end up deciding to go to a father college? I do long distance. Hi. <laughs> Drink that tea. Don't look at me like that. You come home with <laughs> Michael's clothes all the time. That's different. You can just tell me you're dating. It's kind of obvious. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Oh. Charlie? Uh-oh. I think we got this. Okay. Handle this nicely, woman. Do, do a good job here. I'll leave you two to. Uh, Maybe you should stay. Talk. Be a mediator. I'm sorry I snapped. Okay, good thought. I'm always going to worry about you, Charlie. That you is fair. It. I'm your mom. She, yep, true. But I know I can be overbearing. Yep, a little harsh, a My little mom much. Is a bit like this, too. Friends in the family. Well, she was never very nice to me. She oh. was controlling and. But I can be quick to anger, and that's unfair on you. It's true. Um, you are she, about you're a media, and you acknowledge it. That's what matters. I would feel much less worried about you if you waited a few more weeks, just till your GCSEs are over. Fair. Wait a few can weeks. Can be a compromise? Yeah. 
You can do it, but in a few weeks, once you've done the GCSEs. Okay. There we go. Thank you, Charlie. I love a good mature conversation between an uh, overbearing parent and a te too. grumpy teen. Love it. They come together and talk. Not so hard, people. What's going on there? Uh, they're gonna realize. Yep, it did. Oh, it's gonna keep happening. Yes, do good at school. Focus on school. Get through that. Then you guys can focus on you too. Wow, we're already here. The this time jump in, in this season alone is insane. We're gonna be in like college next year or uni. Is that your mom? Yeah. Oh my gosh, happening again. Imogen, are you sure you've got enough stuff? <laughs> Probably not. Well, I had to reduce my skincare routine, so I had a whole other bag. <laughs> we'll drive up that morning. <laughs> Bye. Nick and the girls on the road trip. I love it. It's literally only 15 minutes away from your house. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's not bad. Studying art, law, or politics, international relations. Oh, really? So do you do much he doesn't know. We all live pretty close by, so we'll probably just uh, stay at home. I don't want to stay in Truem. I want to go somewhere new. I get that. Oh, I, 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 I went as far as I could while staying in state. Need my people around me. What did you like about Kent? That's your top choice, isn't it? Uh, yeah. You didn't yeah. seem that thrilled by it. At home, my mum won't be on her own and be close to Charlie. What about when Charlie goes to uni the next year? Yeah. Yeah, he leaves, then you'll still be apart. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. So should you both be staying close and changing your lives? Or should you both go for your dreams and what you want? Ooh, Oxford. Why would I mind? I don't know. Girls and boys. Gay Shared and them. lesbian. It's silly though, isn't it? Girls and boys can just be friends. It's true. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he's bi, so technically something could happen. Because she's like, like, she could <laughs> oh, be bi. It's hard to tell okay. with her right now. Weird. She's figuring no, it out. Bad. Um, not weird. Um, Imogen always just knows what to say. Uh, it'll sound bad if I say it. Oh, right. Well, now you have to say it. Yeah. Really. I'm not sure I did like you. I could see that. that. Okay. That's fine. I think I kind of felt pressure to have a boyfriend. Yeah. Because I was a cool girl. And that's what cool girls do. Yeah, boyfriends, yeah. I liked having attention from boys. I get that. You feel I see that. And I don't think I liked men either. Or my year 10 boyfriend. I don't think I've ever liked a boy. Are you saying you're a lesbian? Think of it. Sorry, that probably makes no sense. No, it makes sense. I, I get it. As far as the school let them sleep in the same room, though. You're my friend. Aww. It's such a pretty school. This is very legally bond. <laughs> oh, she's stressing out. Oh no. So what do you think? I think I kinda hate it. And that's fine. It seems a little stuffy. I don't want Oxford. I don't want any more academia. I have what do you no want? idea what I'm gonna do with my life. Gap that is finished. fine. Gap year, yeah. Uni experience, you know, like meeting new people and uni sports, yeah. societies. I have no idea what I'd do with a year off. I'm sure you and Charlie would think of a few things. Oh. <laughs> what? Tal mentioned uh. the two have been keeping each other. <laughs> 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 everything right now. You don't to. No, no, absolutely not. <laughs> Go talk. This is so embarrassing. 
some rite of passage. Yeah. Important purchases must be made. You must. Are they getting stuff? Yep. <laughs> Awkward. Eat you guys. So this is why I like self checkout. And then Charlie gets. Ow. Oh. Oh, he's like really part of a band now? Oh, I'm so nervous. It'll be fine, Charlie. We'll all be there cheering you up. Aw. It's gonna be oh. uh, in the band. Um, excuse me. Where's my hug? <laughs> <laughs> wow. I've never seen teenage boys so huggy and emotionally like letting it out talk about feelings. Well, I need to make a new one then because this was not my best work. Why are you being all soppy? I just don't think I tell you enough how important you are to me. Oh. It's always good to say that when you can. Guys, we have a band practice. Is this a can we? <laughs> He's got a gun. my boy's house. <laughs> What's this song even about? Uh, that's personal. I Imogen? Uh, Imogen. I know. We don't need to keep talking about the star crossed lovers. Just because no. we kiss doesn't mean we found the one like you guys have. Mm. Definitely about Imogen. Yeah. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Where are we now? Is this Northampton? But yours, Torna, if you want. Anyway, I love you. Bye. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Leeds University. Oh, okay. So, I'm going to be your. T what are you thinking of studying? Maybe sports science or psychology. I haven't really decided yet. <laughs> Seems to like this place a little more. Seems a little more excited. Look at all the gay pride stuff. Love it. Yeah, he does seem to like it. This is the only time he seems to be a little happy about a place. Would you be looking to carry on with rugby at uni? Yeah, yeah, definitely. My partner's actually on one of the teams. Oh, his partner. Some gay people on the team. Look at that. All open, no problems about it. He knows he would be safe and comfortable there. I think this is the one. But how far is it? I was gonna ask if maybe we could make our sessions once every other week, rather than oh. okay recently. I mean, obviously I still have bad days, but less often. That's good. Do you think I'll ever get to the point where I don't have any intrusive thoughts or anything? Probably like, not. Will I ever be free of them? I doubt it. It's one of those things I feel like it's with you forever. But you shouldn't feel that any wobbly moments you have are a failure. Yeah. They're just normal. Yeah. It's part of the process. And I, I think I've realized that e even though I love Nick, I need other people. Yeah. My sister, you need a whole circle of people. Being annoying. A family. Friends. Not a one person. Therapist. Yeah. And that doesn't mean our relationship isn't strong. Exactly. In fact, I think. It's stronger now than ever. Yeah. I hope you know that I'm going to write that down and read it back to you when you're feeling crap. <laughs> How far is it? Four and a half hours. It's a lot, but overall, four and a half hours is not that bad to be away when to make yourself happier though to be happy and who knows in a year he'll move go to a college when someplace only an hour away two hours away four and a half hours is well i feel like for europeans four and a half hours seems like a lot but in america like it's like oh, that's not far at all i drive for one of hours quite often If I move away, it will hurt Charlie. Oh, no. You can't You're a bit worry people about that. Yeah, you gotta do stuff for yourself. You're always putting everyone else's feelings yeah. above your own. Which is how you feel about good at some points, but you gotta worry about yourself sometimes. You have to put yourself first, right? Yes. Go out. Yeah, Charlie will support you. He will. He just wants you to be happy. Exactly. I'm afraid of being away from him. I don't know who I am without him. That's what you gotta go figure out. out. 
yeah you can't be afraid to try something new and be away and be yourself yay head student for him that'll be great distract him too from nick being gone have some responsibility it's okay you can deal with this Oh, look at him, not afraid to show his body a little bit more. A little more open. Look, she's happy for him, too. I love Tori. She's the under, under, unsung hero of this show right now. This season, especially. Oh, this is so cool. What is this? They want to make the concert on time. You're just missing Al. I mean, four days is like 40 years. <laughs> <laughs> okay, firstly... <laughs> Secondly, it's not getting an accident or anything. To be with Elle every single second of every single day. Wow. A grown man. Wow. Jeez. Grown up. Yes, cheers for that. Oh, Michael. Hi. Charles. Oh. Hey, Michael. Okay. I think Tori's with my parents. She's not. She's avoiding me. Oh, uh, why? Well, I uh, may have posed the question about us being boyfriend and girlfriend. Ooh. I assumed you What does boyfriend and girlfriend mean anyway? They're just words we made up to label common experiences and relationships. They shouldn't matter. Technically true. I don't care what society thinks about our relationship as long as... Alright, tell her this, though. ...about it, but now... I wish I hadn't said anything. Toy's a tough one to crack. <laughs> I'm happy Charlie is helping her out now. Little Heidi in the corner. That would be me at one of these. Oh god, oh god. <laughs> She's scattered quickly. Oh, no face we alright. Brother, sister. What does girlfriend even mean? <laughs> You're having a weird amount of trouble with labels for a straight couple. <laughs> yeah, right? We're not a couple. But what are you then? Yes. I'm aware. Feel? I don't ever feel anything. That's a little scary. That true? Yeah, I feel like it's alive. I feel so much. You get scared for Charlie, you're sad. I've tight. seen you angry. I understand what that's like. Don't use your Jeff crap on me. <laughs> you're hopeful. <laughs> you try. Have you not been doing anything? I relate to Tori in that way. You have so much love to give. You don't have to give it all to me. Yeah. Well, I wanted to. Mm-hmm. Um. It's okay. Quarter past four. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna miss the band. Damn. Charlie needs me there. He doesn't. You guys, you both have to get used to maybe not being there for everything. Not being there to see them do everything. You're just gonna have to get start getting used to this. So maybe this is a good, like, okay, it doesn't always work out. You'll still see each other, but you may not see the performance. Oh God. <laughs> Look at Tori and his parents too. The mom has become has really come. Like, changed to me. She's improving. She's trying. I feel like this band thing... Well, I know she was in a band thing, but him being in the band, I feel like, came out of nowhere. Unless I'm forgetting something. Look, they made it. Oh, everyone's so happy, cute. All coupled up, I swear. So many of them, except for all one guy, but he doesn't want to, so that's fine. No, we went on. It's okay. I was okay. He's 
happy. And we've got a free house. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> about going to art school in Europe. Oh. Like Paris. Wow. Berlin or something. Wow. Wow. That's so, that's so cool. That's gonna be hard for him too. So, because my mom's not gonna pay for international travel. I mean, she doesn't even pay for my bus back to school. So. No. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I love his first thought is I just need to get a job now to make money so I can go visit you now. It's time to talk to Charlie about this too. Tell him where you want to go. <laughs> Bye. So are they dating or? I'm not really sure. <laughs> we may never know. Oh, the grandma. You're gonna take his shirt off? Take mine off. Mm. Please. Look at him feeling comfortable. Oh, sure? I'm so proud of Charlie. He's grown so much. I love you. And you are so fucking hot. <laughs> That's how we're ending it. Oh. I was hoping we'd have at least a discussion between Nick and Charlie about Nick going to cop uni, but um, I guess that will be next season's problem. I don't know what they're going to do with next season. Are we going to do like him and uni in a way? Because it's basically the end of the year now. Year's over and we're going to do summer season, kind of like last season was kind of a lot of summer. Maybe this season... Beginning of the season started off with summer. I don't know. Maybe we'll do kind of like beginning of the summer and then start of the new year where Charlie and Tao and all of them, the boys are going to have to be at school at the final year while Nick and the girls are going to be all at uni and everyone's going to be away and separate. And how that's going to work. Oh, next season I feel like it's going to be a complicated one to do. It's going to be complex. There's going to be a lot of issues going on. And everyone's going to be all separated. Which I don't know if I'm going to like that. It's going to be sad. But overall, this season was so fun and seeing more complicated stuff with everyone. Sadly, I do feel like we didn't get to delve quite deep into a lot of other people's. We delved more into Elle's stuff. Into, um... Why can I even remember? never remember his name? I keep wanting to call him Elliot or Spencer, but it's not either, and I know that. And for some reason, I cannot come up with his name. No matter how hard I try. Isaac. We've delved into Isaac and Elle a lot. Charlie and Nick, of course. We dived into a little bit of tar. Not that much. A little bit into Imogen. Not that much, though. Same with, um... Oh, my gosh. Same with only going into a little bit into Darcy. Um... Tori, we did get more of this season than any other season. But I want more, because I do really like Tori and her. And the idea of her and Michael, it's very interesting. I don't know. It's very, like, not a relationship, but they like being together. Maybe that's something Isaac kind of likes. And maybe that's an idea that Isaac hasn't thought of before. Not really a relationship, but like a partner. Kind of like a friend. But a friend that you guys are two very close friends. Something like that, maybe. Mm. Uh... We finally had sex, so we moved on. We got past the PG a little bit. Uh, we dealt with other people having issues besides just Charlie and Nick. We dealt with Nick trying to figure out now. He's trying to realize that he has nothing without Charlie. It's always been him and Charlie. His whole story has been Charlie. 
that he needs to figure out what he wants to do in life, what makes him happy, and he's got to focus on it more. He's got to let himself be happy and do these things that make him happy instead of putting all of his energy into Charlie all the time. Nick needs to focus on himself a bit, just like Elle said. And I think that would be good for him. And I think they both need to learn to have their separate lives. Charlie says he knows he doesn't just need Nick. That there's, he has a whole group of people, support system. So hopefully if Nick does leave, that he will realize he has more. He can still visit. They can still see each other, talk all the time. But he has other people around him to support him. Just saying. All right. This was really fun, you guys. I can't believe we're done already. But we will have another season eventually, and it will happen. I don't know when. So if you like my reactions, please don't forget to go check out my uncut, unedited reactions on Patreon right now. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel so much. Please subscribe. I want you to subscribe so badly because a lot of you watching don't subscribe. So please subscribe, and you can come and join me, and you'll know right away when I start season four when that comes out. Can't wait. So, thank you. Thank you for watching. I hope you're enjoying. I hope you're having a fantastic day. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.